Do you think that the alleged Met Gala's recent report that it might be Kardashian free the reason why the Kardashians are facing their doom? Or is it the fact that they are off the list the reason they are facing their doom? Well, we are going to find out all about that. Sit back and relax. Let me drive you through some of the events that have led to the alleged downfall. Hell broke loose for the Kardashian and Jenners when Page Six posted saying that the Met Gala might actually be Kardashian free. Now, Kim, Chloe, Kylie, Kendall, and their mother, Christina, have been in spotlight and the trend in the TV shows fashion and the world of beauty for years now they became very popular at their tv show keeping up with the kardashians which gave them opportunities all over the world the kardashians have been in a lot of scandals over the years but this recent rumor or scandal might be the spark and the road to their actual downfall and i went to the editor-in-chief of the med gala is reported to have shortlisted the guest list and the kardashians have not made the cut rumors say that the reason why anna is allegedly cancelling the kardashians is because of their recent scandals and that involve all of them being in the news all the time for their bad influence over the people and them losing their popularity some sources say that Anna was shortlisting focused on people with talent, fashion, influence and relevancy and given the fact that Kim and Kanye actually broke up, Tristan and Chloe are also not together, talent as a factor is automatically out of the Kardashians which cuts them off. For Courtney who is married to Travis Baker might take the list and is the only one of the Kardashians who might actually go to the Met Gala this year. Other sources claim that the fact that last year's Met Gala Kim put on a dress of the iconic Marilyn Manor and actually ruined the dress when she adjusted it a little trying to make it fit her. Kim says she lost 16 pounds weeks before fitting in but they say it still didn't fit her so she touched it a little bit. Pop Cave then shared two different photos showing the dress before Kim wore it besides after she did and posted. The dress now shows signs of tearing and several crystals are either missing or hanging off of it. Fans of Marilyn were outraged that Kim would wear the gown and that the Ripley's Believe It or Not Museum would lend it to her knowing how delicate the decades old gown is. The Balenciaga saga might also have a hand in contributing to the downfall of the Kardashians given Kim's relationship with the brand and the fact that she gave a vague response. In October 2022, Balenciaga was accused of sexualizing children in two controversial ad campaigns and a lot of celebrities and people came out and complained about the ad and it was taken off its pages. Kim Kardashian's response is what got people's attention when she said, they're mad if I don't speak out, they're mad if I do speak out and if I don't cancel. They're just mad that if you don't cancel someone in today's society, people got mad at that. But the Kardashian family doesn't only consist of one person, so Kim does not determine if they are doomed or not. But the Kardashian family doesn't only consist of one person, so Kim Kardashian does not determine if they are doomed or not. Let's take a look at Kylie Jenner, who recently lost over 1 million followers on Instagram because she involved herself with the Hailey Bieber and Selena saga. Hailey Bieber posted a screenshot to Instagram of her selfies timing with her friend Kylie Jenner and the screenshot featured close-ups of both of their eyebrows with fans regarded as a shot at Selena who posted a joke on TikTok about mistakenly over laminating her eyebrows. This depopularized Kylie Jenner and made her lose followers while she was trying so hard making TikTok so she could look influential and relatable. Kylie is also reported to have been a climate criminal since she often uses her private jet for a journey that takes only 12 minutes. Speaking of relatable, tell me how one can relate with someone who has a whole closet of design issues and this is a jet for a 12 minute drive. Maybe it's true that sisters have failed to catch up with a trend that focuses more relatable content and not photoshopped photos on Instagram. Other sources say that Kim's obsession with proving how hard she works might have also led to her downfall. In episode 5 of The Kardashians, Kim Kardashian declared that she has to work harder than the average person to earn respect when it comes to her business endeavors. At another point in the episode, Kim raised eyebrows among fans by comparing schemes with the two of the world's biggest and most iconic brands. She said, I'm obsessed with schemes. It's like my baby. All of the big banks and VCs, Apple, Nike, schemes 
like we're in that conversation and that's just what makes me really happy at another point in the episode kim raised eyebrows among fans by comparing schemes with the two of the world's biggest and most iconic brands she said i'm obsessed with schemes it's like my baby all of the big banks and vcs apple nike schemes like we're in that conversation and that just makes me really proud and now to chloe and tristan who have endless drama in their relationship to cheating on her publicly and her always going back to him back in 2021 chloe confirmed on her instagram saying she was back with that with tristan and said people who go through things that are meant to tear them apart and come back together strong than ever other ones that are meant to be together like all that quote meant nothing to him, Tristan went back again and cheated on Chloe and this time conceived a baby with Marilyn Nicholas. Now Tristan and Chloe made an embryo transfer with a surrogate mother just weeks before all the news broke and imagine Tristan did not get the guts to tell her about Marilyn being pregnant but rather he pushed Chloe to do the embryo transfer only to find out with the rest of the world that her man was having another child with another woman moving to chloe kardashian who recently just days back had photos posted of herself in the bathroom while eating in one of the photos posted was a half eating burger seated on top of the toilet seat there was also a sle selection of bites such as chicken wings strawberries and mochi on the floor as well as champagne these images were posted on push founders instagram but fans were mostly intrigued by this particular photo one person commented on the post food in the toilet that's nasty another one added food in the commode and the bathroom floor no ma'am with all this series of the kardashians being slammed by their industry and fans could it be they are finally out of the game let us know what you think in our comment section and stay tuned for more updates like this i'm gonna eat donuts tomorrow though i have a delivery at 8 30 in the morning of two dozen mini donuts my favorite donuts ever are from new york and i eat a dozen by myself but they're literally like this big they're, they're mini 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 When I saw it in Palm Springs. She's talking about the other one. Different dress. Oh, yeah, yeah. I love. Yeah, yeah. I think the Turn around. Don't let her get up the stairs. No! No, 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 Kim! Oh, my God. Kim! To your left! Oh, my God, you guys, don't let her go! This award is very meaningful to me and I'd like to dedicate it to the people I think about, care about, and obsess over more than anyone else, my kids. I know many of 